Janine Perro in 2016. Eduardo Munoz Alvarez AFP Getty Images by Alex Morton August 5 at 1.22 p.m. Email the author at a Saturday night rally, President Trump called them the guys we love. Sean Hannity, Laura Ingraham, Steve Ducey, Lou Dobbs, Maria Bartiromo, all anchors on Fox News Channel and Fox Business Network and routine defenders of the president and his policies. Trump's supporters applauded and roared as he ticked off the names. I'm in trouble, cause I know I left out probably 10, he told the crowd. Fox News host Jesse Waters noticed that one particular name was missing, Janine Perro, a colleague whose Legal Affairs Weekend program airs after his show. Well, Judge Janine's very upset because she was not mentioned there by the president, I think I heard her throw a glass in the green room," Waters said, to smiles and brief laughter from his panel members. The comments soon provoked a reaction from Perro, who suggested that no such thing happened. Really? Perro said on Twitter. You're adding credence to the concept of fake news. Dot at Jesse Waters, really? I wasn't happy and threw a glass in the green room. You're adding credence to the concept of fake news. Janine Perro, at Judge Janine, August 5, 2018 Perro tweeted a response while Waters was still on the air, according to the timestamp, and about half an hour before her program was set to begin. Fox News spokeswoman Jacqueline Giuliano told The Washington Post that Waters was joking and she provided a transcript of his closing remarks. By the way she never threw anything against the wall in the green room, Waters said, according to the transcript. I was kidding, that was a joke, Judge Janine is the best, we love her. I love her, and I know she knows that. Giuliano did not respond to questions about whether Waters had decided on his own to clarify his comments or whether staffers had urged him to do so. It's not clear whether Perro was in on what Waters called a joke. Waters started on the network as a provocative, man-on-the-street interviewer with a history of ambush-style questions. He is demonstrably brash, and his style is obviously understood by his colleagues. Water's name also did not come out of the president's mouth on Saturday, as he name-checked the personalities on his preferred news network. Trump, an admirer of high ratings dating to his hit show The Apprentice, bragged to the crowd that CNN and MSNBC often lag behind Fox News in viewership. So we're blowing them away," Trump told the crowd about the ratings coup, using variations of they and we to describe the preferred network's hosts. And that's good, because those are the people that love us. Read more, even Fox News hosts were gassed after Trump's summit with Putin analysis in the Trump era, the cable news Cold War turns hot.